What up, what up, what up? Ladies and gents, it's a brand new day. Are you going to look at life with a scarcity mindset or an abundant mindset? I'm reading this book and I'm going to touch on it. You know, this book, it speaks about how there's only two paradigms of life, right? Because so much of what we experience in our lives is the result of who we are on the inside and it's communicated on the outside, right? Usually if you're messed up in here, you're going to see life messed up, right? But then usually if you come from a loving, a, a place of a, of a loving mindset, of a loving heart, of a compassionate and understanding heart, usually you get that in return through life and your experiences with people and stuff like that. For example, even we pick up on energy as people, right? Um, how many times have you been walking down the block and you see somebody with an angry face walking fast, you know, speed walking? You move out their way, right? Because you sense their energy, you see what's coming and you're like, let me move away from that. Because <laughs> we all sense energy, you know, we all sense each other's energies and stuff like that. And so for me, I, and again, you know, when I say and I speak, I don't only speak to try to encourage my audience and any, everything like that, but also to try to give insight to myself because the dialogue and the conversations we have with ourselves are so... Move your... F Yo. I just want to walk up to this guy's truck and like... <laughs> we have to decide if we're going to think in a scarcity mindset or an abundant mindset and depending upon how you choose to look at life because it's all a decision we have to understand especially as a as a child of God as a child of the most high that is he is my sustainer right he is the one who supplies everything I need and he says that in his book do not think of what you eat or what you drink you know I, I don't know the full words off, <laughs> off of it but I get the idea don't take too much thought of what I'm going to eat, what am I drink today. Think in abundance. Think that everything will be provided for. And me, I know, to be honest, I'm the master <laughs> at thinking scarcity. You know, from 10 years ago, I was like, the, the economy is going to collapse. This is going to happen. That's going to going to happen. It might still happen. But at the same time, I understand that there are so many opportunities left and right. There are so many people looking to do things. There are so many people that need things. There are so many people that need services, need products for their home, for their lives, for their kids. There's an abundance of opportunity. There's an abundance of money. They're printing it every day. They're giving it out. People are spending it. Where are they spending it? What are they spending it on? Thinking with abundance. Everything is out there. There's more than enough women out there. There's more women than men. And there's men out there too for the women. I'm you know whatever works for you but we have to have that abundant mindset we have to think in abundance and, and again it's a muscle folks it's a muscle we have to train that mental muscle every day and how I do it is you know work out meditate and affirmations and I'm not perfect every day I'm, I'm getting better at it I didn't get to meditate this morning but I did my affirmations I worked out for an hour I felt great sweated it out see my chest looking good you know and I'm gonna go back this evening that's part of feeling that abundance mindset. Knowing that everything I want is out there. I just got to go find it. Nobody's looking for me to give it to me. I have to go get it. I have to seek it and go find it. And when I seek it and find it, I'll get it. And I believe that about any, any, any anything and everything. If you want friendships, if you want love, you got to go seek love. You got to give love. You want money. I don't know if necessarily you got to But you got to give value. You have to give. So I just want to touch on that. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. I appreciate you being here again. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. And I appreciate you being here. Thank you. God bless. Have a great day.